Hey guys, I thought I'd come to you with a continuation of my eBay haul um, to pick up where I left off the last time. Um, I had mentioned that <coughs> I was still expecting some more pieces in and they came today. I went into the office this morning and I got mail. Okay guys, so they're getting significantly better. It's coming quicker because it's still less than a month mailed it. Of course I slapped some of the stuff on when I was at work and actually this piece in my ear is one of the earrings. Really really nice. It almost has a jaded pearlized look to it. I'm going to take it off and I really like it. Um, it's bigger than I thought it would have been but it really is a nice shade of green. It's almost like a jady uh, kind of green. It's not jaded. The per they describe it as a jade stone, but I know this isn't real jade. I have somebody at work who's Asian. and um, But it really looks, really looks real. And it has silver hinges here. I thought this would be on my earlobe by the picture, the way how it looked. But, you know, of course, you never know how these things will look when they come, right? So I'm pleased with it. I really like it. Um, and I'm going to take them out because I'm gonna, probably going to... Yeah, so this is the other one. Two, it's um, adjustable. Thought this was going to be bigger, but it's still fine. It's almost like a... The stones are like brownish, yellowish. I don't remember what stone. Like a citron kind of color and it's actually quite nice I like the fact of course that it adjusts so you don't have to worry about it not fitting okay so that's one thing I've got a pair of uh, earrings another set of earrings. over two dollars I think I probably paid like 99 cents or something for these so yeah that's one. The other ones that I got, I really love. Um, and they are fantastic. I'm going to put them on now that I have this close up. And it's like a copper uh, brass looking color with some little stones, some turquoise stones on there. It's a little bit heavier than I'd like. It's okay. It's tolerable. I'm gonna put that on. I'm a really, I really get some nice things from the seller, and I'm really pleased most of the times with how these things fit. Yeah, like from an old camera that I have, and I find with this on the phone, it's easy for you to find it in your purse. So I really like this. It's like a ladybug, but it's lavender, white, and black. So actually I'm going to thread earrings, like a almost oval diamond shape with purple, yellow, like a burgundy aqua color to it. This is really cute, guys. Really like these. And... As usual, as I said, by the time I finish bidding for, bidding for these things, they don't come up to more than... Sometimes they come up to like three bucks, but it's always free shipping. Depending on how much I like something, I'll pay a certain amount. So yeah, these are really nice. I really like them. Um, and they're a good size. They're not too small. And they're not too big. And I've never really to them it's silver and it does feel kind of weighted and I, I'm thinking it is Tibetan silver and it has some turquoise stones on there. Really cute ring guys. There it is. Four stones on there. Cute, cute. And so it's good on my wedding finger. It's a little bit snug for my other one finger but it, it can go. It just feels more comfortable on the wedding finger. So, yeah, I really like this. 
um yeah so that's basically it okay, guys it's coming on quickly y'all all i have to say summer is here it's 30 degrees outside and it's burning up but i ain't complaining so i came on to show you a couple of things i got off ebay this is going to be in an ebay haul of some sort and i had to go to my endodontist today and story short is the damage for this grill is going to be close to three thousand dollars so but anyway i'm just happy that it will be resolved and i will definitely um i mean guys you probably want why am i telling you about my teeth problems my dental issues but i just feel like and i need mean, so yeah so i'm gonna be doing a couple of root canals in a couple of months so yeah I just came on to say something um whenever you have issues whether it be medical issues dental issues and i'm referring to my dental issues no matter how comfortable you feel with your um practitioner or whomever you're dealing with you know if you're doubtful about certain things get a second opinion because it will save you time and money and pain and agony in the end because now that I have pretty much switched dentists, I have realized that they ha there has been like issues upon issues with my teeth based on routine work, you know, root canals um, or whatever else I have done. I have always had pretty healthy teeth. It's just within the last three years that I've pretty much had um, just a constant issue and I have born with it um, my patients going back to the same person and the same person telling me that there is nothing wrong with me I mean I know the climate and of my mouth I know when things change and this person has caused issues to escalate because of not listening or not being proactive enough to deal with it and I should have left him a long time ago okay and this goes for relationships too okay don't try and foster a relationship with somebody who really doesn't give a damn about you because this is how I feel my dentist felt about my teeth because he actually did not listen to me I went to him last month, spoke to him about a lower um, tooth that I had some huge sensitivity and he charged me, billed me and luckily I have really good insurance or whatever but the fact is it's still your money only to realize when I went to the specialist today that that tooth actually needs to have a root canal done and this is something that I have repeatedly gone to him about because I told him something wasn't right. So yeah that's all i have to say don't 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 take it for granted what somebody tells you because they're a doctor or whatever you are the one who feels things and you have to be proactive yourself in exploring options and figuring out you know if you're having a persistent condition that has not been resolved move on to somebody else i went to my new dentist which is just down the road from me because my old dentist, he's downtown. I have to make a trip downtown every time I go. So I went to this guy across the road, I mean down the road, and he did two x-rays and was able to pinpoint the problems there. A previous root canal that the other one did is now leaking and causing me pain. Okay, so after spending all that money to do a root canal a couple years ago, it's now come back. Yet he was pressuring me for these last couple few months to cap the tooth, to cap the tooth. How can you cap a tooth that has an existing issue that you have not resolved? Anyway, venting y'all. But just, just use your intuition, all right? Take care, guys. I'm going to try and take this hair out. I haven't looked dealt with my hair in days because I've just been in pain. Okay, y'all? So I bought my little cute headband and just coming in from school. Bye, y'all.
they came pretty quickly. Um, I'm really pleased with the shipping. I've never bought from this seller before. It's coming from South Korea. And there are actually some bags. Um, I just saw these bags and I was looking for a bag in a particular color. And although I was looking for leather, these are faux leather. But they're okay because it's, you know, for school to put my books in and my other accoutrements. So I'm curious to see what they look like. So yeah. So I was looking for an orange bag just to sport for the summer like a tote. And I got this. And it's really true, a true orange. So let's see how it looks, y'all. I'm wrapping it before your eyes. So yeah, it's a good size. And I kind of, I just want some, I wanted a couple colorful bags so I could just drop my stuff in. a shiny uh, outside that it has a gloss to it and it has a little coin back here and it's pretty good. The base of it is quite wide so I can really hold quite a bit. It's not too big but it's, it's quite fine. So yeah, and it has like, you know, an exposed seam there. So I really like this. It doesn't have pockets inside, but that's cool. So yeah, this is it guys. I prefer like this too, with my stuff in it. So I'm pleased with that. And um, I think by the time I bid on this thing, it was like 99 cents or something. I don't remember, but all I know, the both bags came up to, from the same seller, came up to 20 bucks, and it was free shipping. The other one I got was blue, and I really like this because it's really going to be quite useful, and the color is like a denim color, so it will go a lot with a lot of things white whatever and i bought it for the same purpose for school so this one is has a shorter strap this one has a nice chain to it with a coin a big enough coin purse here and i really like this it has like a full crocodile finish there and it's like a hobo bag it has a zipper on top. The base isn't very wide. Actually, it is just kind of closed, stuck together. Alright, so hold on, guys. So, yeah. And it's quite deep. And it's fully lined. It has a side pocket here. And I like this. I think I'm going to get good wear out of this. Because typically I buy leather bags, but y'all, these are budget friendly. I mean, work just the same. Not sure how this is going to be. If it's going to poke out like this. The handle might be a bit too short, but I'll let y'all know. Or maybe I'll have to just carry it like this. Um, hopefully... Yeah, I like it. For the price, can't go wrong. So yeah, that's it guys. And I'm wearing that old navy dress. Because it was at the top of the pile and I haven't bought out all my my summer stuff yet. That was just, that's appropriate for like just running around. So I just since it was out, I just put this on this morning. Okay guys, take care. I gotta finish a paper to go to school later. And the hair is almost pulled out. I started pulling out. Most of it is out. The middle is still, some of them are twisted and I just put my little Hope Run View headband thingy over my head to disguise the 
the muck that's going on at the periphery. Alright guys, take care. Bye. Hey guys, um, I hope you're able to see me. It's a bit of a glare behind. Anyway, it is darn hot and whatever. It's sweltering outside. Anyway, I am coming to you with an eBay haul. Um, got some more jewelry. Been really kind of going crazy on buying jewelry on eBay. So, I must have ordered these about a little bit less than a month ago and I just got them. Uh, first thing is, which I got in this little cute little case, the plastic case, was um, a pair of studs. Really cute. They are white and they're a flower with the little rhinestones here and I think this will be really cute for the summer. Um, just very simple and feminine. I like that. Yeah, this is a little package here. I've uh, got a pair of wooden earrings. Not bad, they're okay. Uh, this wooden was a kind of, um, sort of like an animal print detail on there. That's cute, just basic, very light. Disc earring, sort of. I got a bangle also. I like to buy the resin bangles because the wooden ones that I had bought before, the studded ones, the varnish on it kind of lifted and again that is what you get for buying cheap stuff sometimes. Um, I found that one of the bangles, the varnish was lifting and the studs were falling off and I find that the resin ones are a little bit more intact. This is really pretty. It's blue with orange and black hues of it's almost like um, like veining going through really nice and it fits okay what else did I get oh I forgot about these I, I always forget what I order when I order from eBay They are like a shell kind of fabric um, material, but they're floral, very light, pretty yellow with purple and like a blue screen on there. And apparently the last thing that I got was just a plain resin bangle that goes with some other ones that I got similar with this with a pattern so I can mix this with those ones um, that have the pattern and this is just plain brown brown on the inside and it's kind of faded brown with tan on here and it fits so yes guys that's it for my eBay haul take care and see you again bye